What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. What time is it, Nick? It's Mustang week time. Well, yes, kind sir. of. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> well, it's almost that time. It's our weekend before we get on the road trip, so we're getting all the prep. So yeah. we're up here at the famous place. Yeah. We won't mention. I already did the oil change in my car, did a nut and bolt check, and found my axles were a little loose. Or not the, not the axles They're themselves, nuts. but the bolts that hold them together. But uh, got mine all taken care of, so we just got his pulled in the shop. Uh, we're going to get her racked up and we'll be right back with you. All right, guys, we got the cars, oil changes, everything's all good to go for the truck. Road trip ready, boy. So, Sorry, I got my douche flute in my hand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but we're gonna head over to Graham's, get them cleaned up, and we'll see you guys there. All right, guys, we made it over to Graham's. As you guys just saw, we got them all foamed up and cleaned up. And Andy's over here destroying his paint job. <laughs> sure. No, it's for the better. He's doing a clay bar. Uh, my car actually just got paint corrected not that long ago. Um, I just got finished hitting it with some of this stuff. If you haven't used it, it's great stuff. Uh, it's basically like a hydrophobic, like wax kind of deal. Um, kind of hard to tell on camera. Sorry guys, the battery shut off on me. But it's probably hard to see on camera, but it's got a uniform haze all over the paint. Uh, I'm supposed to let it dry for 10 to 12 minutes and then buff it off with a microfiber. And then it's hydrophobic and it looks damn good. So once I get that done, I'll probably bring you guys back on. But uh, I think I'm going to help Andy get this uh, quick detailed again after he finishes up this... Uh, uh, clay bar and then we'll be good to go so we'll bring you guys back on in a second hey guys apologize for the sweatiness i just and I really we have both been out here absolutely killing it for you guys uh, just to get them completely dirty after driving 600 miles but it's just kind of like a yearly thing we do to get them really deep cleaned before we go on this long road trip because this is going to make things that much easier when we go to clean it like when we get there so I just got done buffing off all that haziness from that crap and try to your best to ignore my garbage hood uh, when they repainted it when I had that accident a couple years ago. They didn't do a very good job. But my boss is going to get it repainted for me. So that's lit. Shout out to him. But um, as you can see, this paint is just, it looks better than it ever has before. I never really showed you guys once I got it uh paint corrected but whole rehail but uh yeah i'm ecstatic all i have left is i'm gonna clean all the glass uh probably get the wheels too even though i could give two shits about these wheels but i'm here so i might as well 
But uh, how are things going on your end, bud? Well, look at that door so far. I got the door and the fender buffed We're and here. the roof. We'll look at the roof because the sun's actually hitting it, but I'd, I'd say put if, your uh, feeler visions on. You can feel how smooth this paint is compared to what it was. Yeah, I'd say it's a million times better than, yeah. than what it used to be, but now I got to go get, you can see all the clay residue. Yeah, that's why he's quick detailing it now before we seal it with uh, wax or whatever we plan on using. Yeah, so I, gotta, I got a little bit of the rail on this side, I think, not a whole bunch. So I need to get this side, rear bumper, front bumper, the hood. I still got a long way to go. Mm -hmm. And then I'll put that stuff on, but it already like, before you really couldn't see reflections in the roof panel. Oh, for sure. And now you can see I mean, them. Hell, even like I was telling him, like before you, you breathe on it the wrong way and you get fingerprints or dust or something on it. Right. And I mean, it's so smooth, you can touch it and there's no fingerprint. I mean, if there is, it's very, very, very minor minuscule. compared to what it was but I've still got a lot of buffing to do to get all this stuff yep. off right here because it's pretty thick on here. Uh, look how gorgeous that car is with the sun on it. Can we just take a minute? God damn. <laughs> it, it, like, <laughs> I can't talk. When, when you go so long, you know, like just driving it, like I daily that car for like four and a half years. Oh, so yeah. there was a lot of grime that got beat up on that thing. Like it took the guy three clay bars to get it all out. Three. But uh, like I said, he's buffing his stuff down, getting all the clay I'm gonna grab the water residue off. I'm gonna be healthy. But uh, oh really? You're getting the water? Normally we drink like 17 and a half uh, cans of Coke or. Well, don't where I'm at, but I need a, <laughs> I need a water. But uh, we're gonna finish getting this quick detail, and then we're gonna uh, wax it get it good and sealed up and then just little minuscule stuff and then we'll be good so we'll bring you guys right back on in a minute blooper leftover clay bar let's see if we can get it to stick to the wall we're gonna see how hard we have to throw it just light no oh. dang i'm gonna have to like beam it at that motherfucker if i want it to stick <laughs> i don't think it's gonna stick to the brick no no it might not stick at all i don't think it's going to i <laughs> barely even dented it <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty thick shit. You'd have to like drop it off of a building for it to... Oh! <laughs> Hung on there a little bit. Okay, we're getting somewhere. We're gonna get this. We're gonna get this. Throw it at your car. Nah, I'm good. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> oh, nope. I gotta throw it flat side. <laughs> this is killing my arm, by the way. My arms are already Give so Give one sore. more shot and then if you don't get it, it's fine. Nah. Nope. Oh, well. We tried, guys. We tried. <laughs> All right, guys, I finished it. And holy shit, if you... I mean, those guys that knew us from what we do on YouTube somehow, <laughs> see the car, or anybody that's seen the car prior to now, it's getting to be night and day for you. But damn, she's looking pretty. She's gleaming. And hell, Andy's car is probably the best we've ever seen it after this clay bar. He already quick detailed the whole thing and now he's waxing it. And wow. Like you can Night see. And day. That's me. You can see me. That was never a thing. <laughs> no. So it's looking good. He's probably about 78, 80% <laughs> done. Maybe a little more. I don't know. I'm not sure where he's at on the process. Well, but. I still got to do the hood, both bumpers, and then this side. Okay. But I'm doing the roof now so I can get that. So you're about three quarters of the way done then. That's not too bad. Give or take. But she's looking good. These cars are going to look real nice. And we meant to get around to it. And I don't think we're going to end up getting the video done. So I'll pro you, you probably saw it in the background with my drag pack. And obviously you can see his wheels in the front anyway. For his drag pack. Those were the wheels that were on that. Uh... I ended up getting a VMS set uh, with actual true skinnies in the front, which those are skinnies, just not quite as skinny. Those are 17 or 18 by 8, and mine are uh, 17 or 18 by uh, 5, I think. So they're a lot more skinnier, and then I got the, the bead lock. They're obviously not on it right now. I just got the performance pack wheels on it because we're getting ready to go on a road trip, but 
Uh, it looks it looks amazing on the drag pack. Both of them do. So uh, stay tuned for that. The Mustang Week comment comment. Wow, the Mustang Week content is coming. This is the first video in that series, if you want to call it that. We're going to be editing and recording and every single day, like just like yeah, Mustang just like we did Fest. Mustang Fest last year. So and for all of you diehard people that. Uh, follow us and come up and say hi to us. We know that there were a few of you guys last year that came up and said hey to us. Um, we are gonna be having shirts this year. Yes. People did actually kind of ask us last year whether we were gonna have shirts or not at some point in time. Uh, we did decide to do them this year. Mm -hmm. uh, quantities are very limited. Very limited. Um, we did a limited run. It's a pretty cool design. Our buddy Luis, uh, if you remember way back, he was our camera guy. He still kind of is. He, he does some of the behind the scenes stuff when we're at Mustang Week and stuff like that. But uh, he came up with the design other than the piece that's on the front that you'll recognize from the channel. But uh, without giving too much away, you're going to really like it. Um, like he said, really, really, really low quantity because obviously we're not getting paid to do this stuff. This is coming out of our hard earned paychecks here. Right. So. We just wanted to try to kind of just get dip our toes in the water a little bit just to see if anybody would even be interested in it because they're pretty cool shirts. Yeah, I think they're dope. So uh, you'll see us wearing them and rocking them. The, maybe not the whole week, but a couple days out of the week. Most of the week. Most of the week because we, even us, we only have a, a couple sets. So stay tuned for that. Good thing our place has laundry. This is true. We're going to be washing them every night so we can wear them every day. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Uh, but uh yeah without further ado he's gonna finish this up and then once they're done done if it's not completely nighttime because as you can probably see by that sun uh it's coming down so you can't see much but it's that perfect light where you can just see the lines of the car and how like shiny and how much the color's popping obviously for mine more than his but i mean you can definitely tell the difference i remember when we parked it this morning like this so we could wash them and i was like that's a really good shot and now his car is just menacing with that front fascia but uh yeah we're gonna get this car knocked out and then we'll bring you guys right back on one eternity later all right guys andy finally finished we're both done where our backs are cooked you can't see the sun no more, but luckily it's still daylight enough to where you can see what the hell we're doing. My arms are cooked. But, uh... I like spaghetti noodles. Like you said, I mean, you can see yourself. This thing is looking killer. Uh, we actually, I don't know if I mentioned it, we got another deck the panel just like the one we put on for mine last year, the year before, I can't remember. Yeah, last uh, year. Last year. But, uh, he did the clay bar and the the wax whatever the hell that same one i use hydro slick the hydro slick but uh she's looking good they're officially ready for mustang week because it is back yes, under sir. the new owner so we'll see how it it goes but we'll bring you guys along with us it's, but uh we're gonna get rowdy yeah it's it's gonna be fun like we said we got some shirts coming for you guys uh if you're interested we will be selling them. Bye, 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 bye. It's very, very low stock. Uh, the way we have them priced, it may seem like a lot, but we have a good bit into them. Right. So, And keep in mind, guys, if you buy the shirts, we'll do more. Yeah. If there's, if, if there's a lot of demand for it, we're going to keep doing it every single year. And it's just one of those things to help us get our brand out there. Because whether it's you liking the video, you subscribing, you buying a shirt, it helps us at the end of the day right and we do this because we enjoy it because we are obsessed with what we do like obviously we've been out here Not breaking our back clay bar with clay bar. no I learned but that. we're obsessed with the cars building them right. spending god knows amount of money on true stuff just to impress some random people we don't know and to make us happy at the true. end of the day so help us out We'd really appreciate it, but stay tuned for that. Um, this is the first video, like I said earlier, of the Mustang Week series. Uh, 
So at this point, we'll see you on the drive. Yeah, we'll right. see you guys on the drive. That'll be the next video for the drive down there. So stay tuned for that, but we'll see you guys in the next video. See you at the beach. Peace. Peace.